assalamu alaikum friends here we have a one new topic reduced row clone form for the five by five matrix five equations and five variables so here i'm going to use the technique of reduced row clone form so for sake of time i use the already completed work corresponding matrix for this system will be Five, two, one, zero, zero, one, one, three, zero, 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 two, three, one, zero, two, zero, one, and two, two, zero, zero, one, five. Five, two, zero, zero, zero. So this is the corresponding matrix from uh, from the system. In reduced row equation form, our target is to make the diagonal entries equals to one, and rest of all entries should be zero. This is our target. So I am using elementary row operation, basic elementary row operations using. From first, if I divide R one by five, then this will be five two by five one over five zero zero and divide by five, and this will be one both sides. And now, my target is to make them them all entries should be zero. So this two entries already zero. So here I need. R two minus R one, and here R five minus two times R one. Then these both entries will be zero. And other entries, let me write them. This minus four by five. This is minus two by five. This is one, and this is five. And here is minus two and two. This is three by five. This will be fourteen by five. A zero zero, and this will be five by, and this will be one. So from first operation, we see that. Our entries are now change. These all entries are zero. Now the second diagonal entry should be one. So for this, for this entry, we will just multiply five by three from R two. Then this entry will be one, and this entry will be fourteen by three, and this will be five by three. Okay, now these all entries should be zero. For this all three, this is already zero. For this one, we need to multiply this R four minus two times R two, and this one R five plus four times four over five R five. So they make they will be zero. This will be two minus two plus four by five. Minus twenty eight by three one two and this will be minus ten by three the new entry minus ten by three and this will be plus fifty six by fifteen same same and plus four by three so now this entries will change this will zero again zero and here. The new entry will be minus twenty-eight by three, and this will be ten by three, and this minus two by three. Now, this entry should be one because this is diagonal. For making this one, just dividing R three by two, so two, two, and two. So. This entry is one. 
Now this two interest should be zero. For making them zero, just multiplying R four plus twenty eight over three R three and R five minus ten by three R three. Then here this two interest will of course zero and this plus 14 and minus 5 here plus 14 by 3 and here minus 5 by 3 and they should be same because this is 0 this is nothing but 0 so here change into will be 15 and minus 4 and this increase will be 4 by 9 so 20 by 3 and 10 by 3 now this diagonal to be 1 so R4 dividing by 15 so here 15 and this 15 will 1 this 20 by 3 will 4 by 9 and this minus 10 by 3 will minus 2 by 9 now for making this entry should 0 so just R5 plus 4 times R4 then this entry will be 0 and this will be 10 over 3 plus 16 by 9 and here will be minus 2 by 3 minus minus 8 by 9 then this 10 by 3 over 16 by 9 will be 9 over 40 46 over 9 and this is minus 14 by 9 Now this last one, so I'm just multiplying 9 by 46 by R5. So this is 1 and this is minus 7 by 23. So now this upper entries should be 0. For making them 0, just uh, adding R4 minus 4 by 9 R5 and other one R3 minus 1 by 2 R5. Then there will be minus 4 by 9 minus 1 by 2 plus and this entry will change and this will minus 2 by 23 and this will 7 by 46 and this both entries will 0 now making this one 0 just nothing but to R3 minus 3 by 2 R4 so this entry will 0 and this will be 5 by 3 this will be 10 by 46 this is all right sorry it is by mistake now this two entries should be 0 for making 0 them Operation, applying operation R1 minus 1 by 5 R3 and R2 minus 14 by 3 R3 so then these two entries will 0 and this both result will change and this result will be 207 over 230 and this is 8 by 23 
in the last for making this entry should zero nothing at r1 minus 2 by 5 r2 then this last entry will be zero and this will be 37 by 46 so here so this is what we call reduce row equivalent form in this form we just make all diagonal entries should be one and rest of them will be zero and the corresponding values are just like this one this is value of x1 this value of x2 x3 x4 x5 so on thank you so much for watching this video